Hi, I'm Mark from ereplacementparts.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the circuit board on a KitchenAid stand mixer. The most common symptoms of a bad circuit board, also commonly called the phase board, is that the mixer, when you turn it on, just goes to full speed. Or sometimes, when you turn it on, it won't start up at all. If it won't start at all, it could be the phase board, or it could also be the control board inside your mixer. So that'll be a little bit more involved repair. But we're going to show you how to replace the circuit board now. To access the circuit board, we need to remove this rear cover. It's held in place with a single screw. The circuit board, or phase board, is located right here. It's held in place by a single screw on the back of the board. And I'll just remove that screw. Now there's four wires that we need to remove from the mixer. It's a good idea to note where the wires go before you remove them. But if you've already taken them off before watching our video, don't be too concerned, as KitchenAid has labeled each of the wire locations as to the color of the wire. I'll remove those wires now. Now we need to remove the board from the mixer. It's kind of a tight fit, but if you just slide the circuit board up over the control board, then it'll slide right out the side, like that. Now we'll go ahead and install the new board. The key to reinstalling it is to slide it back and down as far into the mixer as you can. Once it drops down lower than where it should be when it's mounted, now you can raise it back up into its little pocket where it mounts and reinstall the screw. Like that. Now we just go ahead and reinstall the wires. Like I said before, the wire locations are labeled. This one's labeled RW for red-white. This one RD for red. On the other side, BK for black. And BL for blue. And now we just reinstall the rear cover. As you can see, replacing the circuit board on your KitchenAid mixer is an easy repair you can do yourself, and it'll save you a lot of money at the repair shop. If you found this video helpful, please feel free to leave us a comment or ask a question.